Oi boys, welcome, welcome to another video on the channel. We are back for some state of origin action. We have a little preview here, simulation of the second game. Now there's been plenty of changes to both sides, but the team worse off obviously would be the Blues here, no Nathan Cleary. They've got Mitchell Moses in the halves. Also Latrell Mitchell ruled out as well for yet another origin match. A massive loss, that's, uh, that's plenty of strikeout wide unavailable for the Blues. They do however still have Tom Trebojevic. And credit's the one that will be jumping back into the centers. But yeah, kick back, enjoy, as we get ready to chop it up and do a little play calling to this AI gameplay. Like the last Origin simulation video, uh, these halves are 15 minutes, so there's time for plenty of action. I would be shocked if this ends, uh, if this ends up being a low scoring game like it typically does, in like 7 minutes or 9 minute halves. Oh, kill him! It looks like Queenslandia will be the first to score points. Holmes, the first try scorer. Definitely won't be showing like the easy goals. Another easy line break, a clean one for Daily Cherry Evans. The skipper. 10 meters out, can Queensland score another try here? This is Cam Munster. Running into traffic. The wide ball. Some drop down cheese on the way. It's Patty Carrigan. If you haven't already, I did preview the game like fairly early when the team list got released. As I say, yo, surely Walsh is going to cut him off here. No, it doesn't end up being Walsh. That's Dave Fafita. Turbo. Ugly pass. One handed grab. Ooh, he almost caked at Mitchell Moses, but they get some drop down cheese of their own, the Blues. I did see people calling for Freddy's head if uh, the Blues do lose this series. My question to you is, who do they bring in? Because I mean, if Freddy can't get it done and he's got Joey helping him out. I did see some suggestions of like a Ricky Stewart or a Des Hasler, which is some good cause. I do wonder if it's Freddy alone that makes these selections or like has the final say or is it a collective? That's been making these terrible selections. Back on the inside, the big old dummy from Mitchell Moses. That is the softest of tries. Queensland looking a little checked out at the moment. But yet my preview, I did have a Queensland victory, obviously. But the margin was 13 plus. I think I think I'm gonna go back. Walk that one back. Go back to a 1 to 12, a close game. A respectable efforts. I'm really hoping for Queensland to sweep them though in the other uh, grand scheme of things. Man, this could be another try coming up. Nuai drills it and it's James Tedesco now. Bro. It's looking rough here for uh, for Queensland. Holy Another error. I guess it's a bit backwards to me tipping the 13 plus with Latrell. As they stroll through, another soft try. This time the skipper will get on the board. Who's going to be the one to get Queensland back into this? Oh, that's not going to help. <laughs> another bloody error. That's tough. They have the 14 point lead. This is Frizzell, taking contact just beyond the halfway line. Payne Haas gets put through a gap. Gets away from two, three. Oh, Payne Haas at Suncorp. What is going on? I did not see a 20 point deficit on the cards. Can Queensland somewhat save face? Bring it back down to a respectable loss. A little short ball, a little, a little juggle, but Flegler reels it in. Another bopper getting over the line. Love to see that. Surely get a one more for the boys. Losing by 16 at Suncorp is crazy. It's a try scorer, Flegler. Nice little drive there. 
Two feet the straight through. Don't get pulled up. I think, uh, I think checked out is an understatement. As they send this to the, to the posts, it hits the post. And Lindsey Collins, another big boy getting over. It's the Alex Twile effect. I was going to say life imitating art, but it's the opposite. That's pretty hectic. Okay, so once again, the video game has New South Wales winning. This time by an eight point margin. James Tedesco picking up man of the match and Valentine Holmes, the first try scorer. That's actually a pretty decent prediction. But yeah, as always, if you enjoyed, be sure to write a shit at that like button. Thank you for tuning in and I'll see you. Yeah.